gang, what up, Smart Rapid Gang? Today we're talking about three ways Shibai. you can build hype for your new single. Get everybody excited because whether you believe it or not, this is actually more important than anything. The hype building around something is what makes everybody go, what's that? What's that? You know what I'm saying? Give me? People love hype more than they love the full project sometimes. Just the hype of the project. The idea that something amazing is coming gets everybody excited. Have you ever noticed that when somebody that you're a fan of starts talking about a project or a new single coming out, you get really excited about it, like super excited if you're actually a fan of them and you can't wait for it to release? Then that excitement builds and builds as the time gets closer and you know the time's coming all the way up until when it finally releases. Then if it's really good, you're even more excited. But if it sucks, you're let down. Well, you being able to build that excitement inside of potential fans and your current fans is a really big thing that you can do to get every excited and talking about your new songs which means that when you drop it it'll spread a lot faster and you do this before they even know if it's really actually good or not this is very powerful because you can get a lot of people talking about your music before it even releases think about that it's very powerful just from pure excitement i'm rob level this is smart rapper and we're going to talk about that today right after the intro yeah, yeah, yeah. i do not have time to You're always gonna want to keep your audience's attention on the new single, okay? That's just how it is. But you can't keep doing it in the same way, otherwise it's gonna get boring and they're gonna catch on. You have to consistently find ways to talk about it and approach it from different angles to get them to want to talk more and more about it because they get re they get excited. And that excitement about the single makes it seem like it's more than just a song, right? Because a song is a song, but everything you build around it is what it, it, it adds to it. it's like it's more than a song it's like it's this and I can't wait for it when you let them know about the single but give them more information about a single it becomes more than just music or just a song so how do we go about doing this number one I love this one a great way to make people more a part of your single that you're releasing is you can choose super fans to be a part of your video in some way and I did this before and it helped me a, t a tremendous amount. So I'm not just like making stuff up, okay? So what I did for my song called Dragon Sneeze is I took, I think it was over a hundred fans I had and they all lip synced one bar each of the song that I had, that gave them the song, they lip synced it and we cut together the, all the video of them saying the words. I even put the city and the, and the country or both that people were in when they actually lip synced it. And this showed that I had fans around the world in this video. When you get fans involved in the project more than just listening, they become hardcore fans. It's more than just music to them. It becomes a part of their life in some way. And they'll share with every single person that they come across because they feel cool that they were included. Remember, it doesn't have to be them lip syncing the song. It could be a contest, a single artwork competition. They could win a prize of some sort somehow or more. You gotta be creative. Second way that you can build some buzz and hype for your new single. You gotta create something around the single release date that makes people more excited for the day that the song's gonna release. Maybe they're excited for your single, but would love to see a vlog of you as well. And you make them both release on the same day. Why you're doing this is because it's giving them two reasons to pay attention to that exact date. The single comes out, the vlog comes out. Oh, but also this comes out. I have a new t-shirt that day too. You see, like when you, when you start packaging all these things, it gives them more of a reason to really want to pay attention when that thing's coming up because it gives them more things to think about. Remember, you're a creative artist and being an artist is being creative too when it comes to marketing. You gotta be marketing creative as well. Number three, a way to hype up the song. Tell a story about how the single came about. A funny story, an emotional moment, or the theme and the idea behind the song. If they know more about the song, such as the true place that the song was created from, when they hear it finally, they'll feel it more because they know it's more than a song to them. There's a story behind the song. A great example is you hear songs from artists, you'll hear the song, you'll really love the song, but then when you find out the backstory of the song, you go, yo, right? You, like you, you feel the song even more like, oh, that's why that makes sense. And then you also, what's great about this is you then share that story with other people. Every time that song comes on, if you know the story and they don't, you tell them the story. Think about that because when that happens, this means that your audience is then maybe even playing the song in order to share the story with somebody, which means your music spreads from the story and the music, which helps your music spread further. This is why you create different angles. I'm gonna make other videos on how to create angles around the music because that's what PR is. That's how you create publicity for yourself. Whole nother video, crazy stuff, but let's go over those real quick again. One, you can include your fans. Okay, include them, put them in a video, lip sync contest, do something like that, okay? Number two, hype up the day. 
make sure there's a bunch of stuff happening on the same day, get everybody excited about a lot of stuff going on. And number three, tell people the story about the song to get them more excited and also allow them to have more reason to share it with people. You just became a smarter rapper. Please check out the Rap School channel. I just built it. It's gonna have videos releasing on it on a regular basis, so please subscribe to that. I'll put a link below for you, all right, gang? Please hit me to like, please hit me to comment. What do you think about these? Are you gonna try some of these? Let me know below in the comments. And also, I'll put a link to my Dragon Sneeze video so you guys can see the whole video of everybody lip syncing it. I put that thing together myself. It took about a week to do and get everybody to, to send in the things and distribute the lines to each individual person, but it came out really cool. I'll see you guys again tomorrow with another video. Keep hustling, gang. I'll see you at the top.